It's beginning to look a lot like Vlogmas Everywhere you go And it makes me so happy You're spending your holiday with me Happy Vlogmas Once more Okay The living room Dining room, kitchen. We can't bring anything in yet. Are you ready yet? Okay. This is the bedroom. Here's the closet. Such a nice closet. Okay, you guys. So it is. Sunday morning. We didn't go to bed last night till maybe about like, I don't know, after midnight. We went to Walmart at like 11 something to get a shower curtain so we could take a shower. And yeah, so I wanted to show you guys our progress so far. We've not made that much progress, but we made a lot of progress all at the same time. So let me go ahead and show you guys. Okay, so this is the kitchen. I have a bunch of bubble wrap everywhere, wrapping paper everywhere that was holding all of these mugs. Isn't that terrible? A lot of mugs. And, oh yeah, um, one of my housemates and I went to the grocery store last night. We bought some groceries. We made dinner. It was so good. Pasta and chicken. So that's good. Okay, this is our progress in the kitchen so far. Had my first cup of coffee in our new place this morning. In my Baby It's Cold Outside mug. How nice is that? Setting up a little coffee station right here. I think that'll be super cute. Also, I did do what I told you guys I'm going to do and burn the chocolate lava cake candle as my very first candle in my new place. I loved it. It was so good. I definitely recommend this candle. It's just fabulous. Okay, then we actually got our sofas, so yay! Okay, there's the first one. That's a sofa. That's a love seat. My uncles helped carry that in. And we got this lamp. Um, I put a bulb in it so it works. That was when my housemates got that. This is where our dining room table is going to go, but right now it just has boxes. We should be getting our dining room table today. And let me come walk you guys over here. You can look at the floor. Okay, and here is the bathroom so far. Oh, oops. Isn't that so nice? We have a little toilet paper basket. This is a shower curtain we bought. How classy. Look at that. So cute. And the let's roll sign. I'm using this towel. This is actually my housemate's towel, but I forgot my towel at home. So she's letting me borrow one. Okay, now we go into my room. Okay, guys, no judgment. It's a disaster. This is what I have so far in my room. Already set up my Bath and Body Works, of course. And my little blue Christmas tree. We're setting up our um, four foot tall Christmas tree today once we get the table in so we can see. And also we're getting internet today. And this is my closet. It looks good up until this point and then this is where it turns bad. Um, so that's all the stuff I still have to work on unpacking, hopefully today. And I think I'm going to keep my sweaters folded up right there because, um, they kind of were falling off the hangers when I have to hang them up this high. Like, just to give you guys a reference point, this is about where the top of my head is, is right there. And so that is really, really high compared to where the top of my head is. So 
obviously we have a little bit of closeting issues but that's not too bad and we finally finished putting together the desk so I need to put stuff in there today I'm about to go to my parents house I probably will actually vlog about that too but yeah that is everything so far Okay, you guys, so it's Sunday evening. This is pretty much the only progress that I made in my bedroom is with the desk. So, yay, my desk is done, has my chair, my drawer has everything that I need inside. So that's good. It looks cute, very functional. And then on to the living room where I have like one of the biggest blessings ever because I didn't think I was going to have a Christmas tree. And now we have a four foot Christmas tree thanks to my grandma and uncles who um, gave me their extra one. So it looks super cute. We put red and gold ornaments on it um, that I got from Walmart for $5. Um, each and then also we got my roommate's um bookcase her tv stand for our tv which is nice we put in the two side tables from one of our old co-workers that she gave us and here's the other side table it's very nice and then in the kitchen we made some progress let's see um did like the little coffee bar, which is nice. Have the drink board there. And we literally unpacked all of our kitchen boxes. So in here we have bowls and plates, cups, cups, cups. Out of season cups go at the top. Then in these cabinets, we have to go Tupperwares. And um, some more to-go Tupperwares in the crock pot. In this cabinet, we have all of my mugs and cups on the first shelf. So that's nice. And then we have in this drawer is nothing yet. This drawer is nothing yet. Down here is empty right now. Then on this side, we have this drawer has utensils. This drawer has like miscellaneous cooking items. Under here, we have pots and pans, baking trays. And then in here, we have pot holders, um, oven mitts. Oh, oops. dish towels and a drying mat and then empty down here we have empty um, cabinet and everything is looking pretty daggone good so that's nice okay you guys so today I'm showing you a apartment tour finally of our completed apartment so this is our pantry just looks just like that and then in the kitchen, we have all these cabinets, a sink that's full of dirty dishes, a pile of mail, and all that good stuff. So our kitchen is done. I love our little coffee station the most. We have a place for my Bath and Body Works candles right there. And then our living room, we have the Christmas tree in the corner. Some presents are there already our um, dining room table then on this little white stand I have my little Christmas wrapping station you can see the um, gifts that I completed wrapping thus far and then just all my extra um, wrapping paper that hopefully I can find something else to wrap in and then here is our living room right here we have the two couches Two side tables that we got from a coworker's house, a lamp that one of my roommates found at Goodwill. There's the other couch, a bookshelf from my friend's house, and this little um drawers and then TV. And then next I'll show you guys my room. 
please be forgiving it's a little bit of a mess okay you guys so here we have my bedroom now don't be alarmed that huge pile of stuff is for an upcoming video and then for me to decorate for christmas but i didn't want to decorate for christmas before i did this apartment tour so in here i have my wallflower plug and then my desk this is where i do my graduate studies is right at that desk i got it on amazon for like 110 dollars then we have my piano, my dirty laundry basket. Don't have to worry about that. Um, my nightstand has a picture and then my wax station. And then I have my bed. It usually doesn't have these two bags on it, but it's just because I'm about to go bake gingerbread cookies at my parents' house. And I think I'm going to be spending the night there. So I just packed a little overnight bag. Then we have my locker here. Just ignore the stuff on top of it. It's for Christmas decorating. Just calm down, people. Then we have my bookshelf. It has my tree up already. And then all my Bath and Body Works of goodies. And then um, back there we just have like extra paper and my budgeting binder. And then this is my closet. So I have my clothes there, my clothes there, my clothes there, my clothes in there. Then we have shoes, um, filming, and ukulele stuff, and books, and um, planning stuff is down there, and like notebooks. And then back there is just all my empty bags, like I have a bag of bags, and then I have my Bath and Body Works like ginormous bag with extra um, little candle holders in it, so if I ever need to move my candles... And up here we have all my candles that are not being used right now. And in here we have all my candles that are like, you know, winter candles that are seasonally appropriate even if I'm not using them. So yeah, you guys, that's it. That is my new apartment that I'm living in. I'm so excited that I was able to show you guys today. I've been working on unpacking and finally after finals, I had the time to finish unpacking so that it looked like semi-presentable. And now I'm just in a rush to go to my parents' house because I need to go bake some gingerbread cookies. Um, I'm going to my very first ever cookie exchange party tomorrow. I'm pretty pumped about it because I've honestly like been kind of like a recluse lately. Not really hanging out with friends, not really hanging out with people. And I need to get better at spending time with my friends when I have off school. And also, I just wanted to give you guys an update on my whole, um, like, cat situation. So, Milkshake is feeling much better now. Um, I know that he still has the tumor and that it's not going to be going away anytime soon. Or it's not going to be going away at all, honestly. Um... But he's been eating uh, Fancy Feast soft food, like maybe almost two cans a day. So I'm just so thankful for that. I don't know what it is about Fancy Feast soft food that he loves so much. But whatever it is, I hope it never changes. Um, <clears throat> like for a while, because I was really afraid that like he was going to pass away. Um, like he picked his spot and everything of where he wanted to pass away. But... Now everything seems a little bit more hopeful. He seems so much more comfortable. He's meowing. He's going downstairs and sitting by his bowl whenever he's hungry and wants more food. Um, we have a litter box for him upstairs when he wants to be in his spot or downstairs. And um, he just is doing so much better now. So I'm excited to go see him when he's in happier mood. I spent um, maybe like three hours with him on Wednesday and he was doing so good sitting under the Christmas tree just being like more like himself um, and I wanted to let you guys know about how my wax melting um, like advent calendar that I made up myself is going so I did uh, pick out one more since I've been filming so I didn't include it on the film so the one that I tried that I picked out in a video, I'm pretty sure, is um, Winter Palace. And this one, I like it a little bit more than Snow Candy. Like, uh, I think I could burn it again, but there's something a little bit weird about it, a little bit off about it, because it's a sweet scent, but then it also has, like, this musky perfuminess to it, and it just, 
like throws me off a little bit and it smells good but it doesn't have that much of a throw to it so that is winter palace and i don't think i would purchase this one if you know in a clamshell if it comes back next year and then we also have the other one that i drew out which is in grinch cake this one i've really been enjoying it lasted me for a couple of nights it's just like a generic um like sweet scent it kind of smells more like frosting to me than it does cake batter you maybe just get a little bit of the cake batter but mostly i feel like it just smells like that super super sweet icing how that tastes but this one just smells like it because you can't eat it because it's wax but this one's grinch cake i think i would purchase this one again in a clamshell and then um this one I know I already told you guys about. This one is a White Christmas and I really, really love this one. I would definitely repurchase it in a clamshell if she brought it back next year. And now I'm going to draw my next one. So yay, let's go ahead and see what I pick. What is it? It is Vintage Christmas. Yay, yay, yay. Okay. Hmm. This one smells kind of like a craft store. Kind of a little bit like a crayon or something. Hmm. I cannot put my nose on it, but look, it's so fitting for the evening because I'm about to make gingerbread men cookies and it's a little gingerbread lady. Um, so yeah, that is the next one that I will be melting is in Vintage Christmas. I will let you guys know what I think about it on Sunday in my next Vlogmas video. That video will be about my holiday haul. So yay! And also leave a comment down below about your favorite thing to do in the winter time because I want to know. I like talking to you guys. So yeah, just leave a comment down below about what you like to do in the winter time or about anything that you want to leave a comment about. And I'll see you on Sunday. Until then, make sure that you stay positive.